the studio recording. One thing which I, I think that, that there's so many ways to record an instrument, there's so many ways to record a drum kit. Um, and I could probably sit here and talk for an hour about miking techniques and uh, concepts. But at the end of the day, um, in terms of giving advice, I think the most important thing is the playing. And it's knowing what to play in order to get the best sound. And there's one thing I'm going to uh, say. W one thing I figured out very early when I would do a take and then I'd go back and listen. I realized that in some of my tom fills, I was playing the bass drum. But the problem is, it may be fine from a timekeeping point of view, but sonically, it doesn't work because you've got a low frequency from the kick drum and you've got the low frequencies from the tom-toms, it ends up, in a way, almost cancelling out and making the whole kit sound smaller, and making the track sound smaller. So what I started to do was actually stop playing, except for the fill. But the fill has to carry the groove. The groove must never stop. So. And once I figured that out, I use that a lot. I will not, a lot of, I notice a lot of drummers will play and they'll play the bass drum underneath, like. Now, that's okay, but from a sonic point of view, the bass drum and the tom-tom hitting at the same time is actually gonna make it sound smaller. So this is what I would do. That way, that leaves a lot of air and a lot of space to reproduce the sound of these drums, but without breaking the groove. It's, it's, uh, it's a little tip, but it's something I found very, very useful. Um, and this goes with a lot of things. In order to get the right sound, it's not just the tuning, it's the way you approach it, the level that you play out. Um, playing a little bit quieter will pull more tone out of the drum. Groove-wise, if you're having trouble with the groove, if you lighten up a little bit, the groove will start to happen. So there's all these little uh, studio tricks to do. They're not really tricks, it's just a concept. That's all it is, really. So that's, uh, that's a, a little uh, concept to start with.